there are so many real life problems or situations that can be solved using the concept of linear equations in two variables. For example, we have this problem. A plant is 5 centimeters tall and growing at a rate of 3 centimeters a month. What equation describes this situation? So to know the equation, we are going to represent some variables. For example, we let x be the number of months since there are two variables involved here, the number of months and the height of the plants. So we let x be the number of months and y be the height of the plant in x months. So our equation will be since uh, at present it is 5 centimeters tall and is growing 3 centimeters in a month, the equation will be y is equal to 3x plus 5 where 3 is the constant rate and 5 is the the height of the plant at present okay so after x months the plant will be uh, will reach the height as uh, the value of y okay another example we have this one and the same problem but it's asked for another one so the same problem, but the question here is, how tall will the plant be after 6 months? So, after 6 months, we are going to uh, substitute in the equation that we have made. The y is equal to 3x plus 5. So, since it's asked for the height of the plant after 6 months, we are going to substitute 6 to x, since x is the number of Month. So, we have y is equal to 3 times 6 plus 5. So, 3 times 6 is 18 plus 5. So, we have 23 centimeters. So, after 6 months, the plant will be 23 centimeters tall. So, another example, we have this one. An internet company charges a 6,000 peso set up or installation fee. And then, the charge 1,000 pesos a month after that. Use Y for the total amount to be paid in X months. And uh, find the rate of change. So, what will be the rate of change? Since the equation that describes the situation would be Y is equal to 1,000X plus 6,000. This 6,000 is the installation fee. And 1,000 the payment each month so we have this equation y is equal to 1000 x the number of months plus 6000 the installation fee and then this y the total payment after uh, x number of months so the rate of change is its slope so based on the equation this is since slope intercept form the y the coefficient of x is the slope. This slope refers to the rate of change of uh, in the problem. So this is the rate. The rate is 1000.